Oh wait, um, there we go. Hold on. Probably be best if I just I turn on my lights. Ace Attorney Trilogy. Okay, now I can just pop out the chat, have it set to live chat. Then I can close this. If I have the game, no, nah, I'll just do that. Uh, stream. You know, I do appreciate the little, like, uh, thing that the, just, okay. I need to check my sound settings. I don't know if this is the same problem last time, but. Um, screen shake by vibration. Uh, key configuration. Okay, no. Nothing I could do there. I don't know why it's not working. So, my Go XLR has this thing where I can, like. Hold on. First, let me just go in. Actually, I wonder. Oh, I can't choose. See, I'm gonna mute this. 
I go over here. Okay, yeah. There is no um sound coming from thing. Okay, there we go. I don't know why why I'm not able to like choose what the output is. Excuse me for a moment, guys, while I... Channel 2 is for game. A quick mic setup just to make sure that everything sounds right from where the okay okay sorry about that I just had to make sure that the microphone was set up because I'm having to, I have to shift it around like I need to I, have, I might have to swivel it over to like the console area and then I might have to swivel it back to here so that I can do uh, so I can talk to friends and such Grouchy. hey Dutch what's going on How does it sound? That's probably what I should have done in the first place. I'll be right back, guys. I gotta go grab something. Oh, crap. I gotta reach and grab that. Ugh. Uh, so we're gonna get so we'll get into the game at some point guys do not worry just first off I gotta make sure everything is right oh also anyone anyone that was here yesterday for the live stream I did the very the very short live stream of uh, Pokemon Scarlet um, I talked about Fixing the problem on why, like, you know, the chat link wasn't working and the switch not getting audio. I've solved this. I've solved the problem. Um, apparently, I forgot to. Okay, so there's a thing in Streamlabs where when you hook up a capture card, you could have it choose to record audio, and you have to click a box that says "Use Custom Audio Device," and then you'll click the the capture card you're using. That's that's what I was doing. I'm gonna go to studio. <laughs> Man, well, since you guys last seen these pair of the headphones, have you? 
would have loved if, like, I don't know, Go XLR at some point comes out with a new, like, board they use. So that, you know, I could do, um, so that they could do headphones, like, USB headphones. That's currently what these are. These are just primarily, you plug it into, like, the end of a headphone, at the end of a USB, and you'll hear that. Also, some good news. Uh, I've got a new nunchuck, and I tested it out earlier. Uh, at first, for whatever reason, the nunchuck disconnected. I want to think it might be the, the Wiimote. Which, if it is the case, then guess what? I got myself a freaking... I got myself a replacement. Just in, in case that doesn't work. Some blueprints in the place. Ooh! That is nice. That is nice. Okay. I got myself a co-host coming in, guys. So. Yeah. Uh, the content. Channel content. I don't see any content, guys. I just need to make sure, like, the music is not so loud and such. Like, <laughs> as much as I... As much as I, you know, trust you guys, I want to try and, like, fine-tune it. Make sure I'm not being so freaking loud. Ugh. This is so weird. Okay, that doesn't sound too bad. Let's bring it down to... Let's see if negative, what negative 30 does. Mic could lower just a little bit. There we go. I think that, okay, you know, that probably sounds a lot better now, uh, when it's like this. that off conserve battery power i'm going to have this full screen but also turned away if i something that i do whenever i whenever since i'm doing live streaming now and all, i no longer look to see if there are people who are in the if there are people in the stream and such if there is like I, I want, I, like, I mentally convince myself, there's someone watching right now. So, let's, you know, 
uh, let's just talk and let's say something. Um, and let's like chat with this individual that's totally watching. Because uh, if I look at the dashboard and I see that there's, like, no one at the moment watching, I just feel bad, you know? I feel very, very sad. I do have to say, though, I am so glad that, um, it's like you guys are able to hear it at a fixed volume and I can adjust the volume to my liking. Well, I mean, that's what I did, and that's what I did with, um, well, just now, like, I adjusted the volume to my liking. It's like, okay, so this is perfect. My, my voice is heard, my voice is heard, but and at, at the same time, um, like, you can still hear the game and such. I still don't know why... does this oh i can't do <laughs> i wanted to go ahead and like play a clip or something like like the <laughs> i've been watching sonic snap cube some of the games i i like i'm not watching because i haven't played them yet uh which actually brings me to another point but i'll get to that later uh, I wanted to play the clip from their Sonic 06 playthrough where Eggman, where Eggman is talking about his account is hacked. He's going to give birth to Cactus. Going to have a birth of Cactuses out of my ass. Uh, I love it. Probably, probably didn't hear it. Because of the because of the game, but like, I absolutely. <laughs> <What? laughs> uh, God, I love Snap Cube. I love some of this stuff. Uh, but what I was getting to. Uh oh. Chat. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. I have just recently got myself, got my hands on a few games. <coughs> so as a part of the like Legend of Zelda homework run, you know, like, uh. I am playing through some of, like, what I think are kind of important games that you should play if you're going before you get into Tears of the Kingdom. If, like, if, like, you know, you have a Switch or something, or if you just want to watch someone play the game, um, I recommend Skyward Sword, then go to Ocarina of Time, then Twilight Princess, then Wind Waker, then Breath of the Wild, and you should likely be prepared for, uh, for Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, but one of the games I got is I managed to get my hands on The Legend of Zelda Master Quest, Ocarina of Time Master Quest, for the Nintendo GameCube. This was a deal. Like, it's a, it's a good deal. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, let me pull this up real quick. I want to see how, how, how much it is. Uh, shopping. Oh, six, six, okay. <laughs> so many selling completed saves. It's like a hundred, close to a hundred dollars. Twenty five dollars for a case of a game. Uh, okay, so, uh, somewhere between, like, a hundred dollars to forty-six, forty-five ninety-nine, dollars whichever one. Um, if you have, like, you know, the, um, if you have, like, a, a GameCube, uh, and you want to play a Zelda game, 
Ocarina of Time Master Quest is good. A lot of the a lot of these games are going on sale, uh, roughly around the same price for a new game. But if you want my personal opinion, uh, if you want like my like a personal site, a uh, site I would recommend. Let me make sure. Oh, oh <laughs> sorry about that. I had to I had to do something. I was doing a video. Um I guess I didn't get it. Well, let me just add it to, uh no, let's just do window capture. So there we go. If you want my personal like suggestions for a site to get it lukeygames.com is really good oh crap like some of the games that i just got in they are in good condition and they are working uh uh let's see uh here it is ocarina of time master quest it's 60 68 dollars which and that's just for a complete Oh, wait, hold on. Well, that doesn't make any sense. If I got complete, then how come it was in the... Oh, whatever. Uh, I, I don't mind. I don't mind. Um, this is like... Uh, uh, well, as it says up here, $68. You're getting two games, alright? When I, I, placed, I purchased this game, when I got it, there are two games. There is the base game, Ocarina of Time, and then there's the Master Quest. Which, the Master Quest is basically the dungeons are more challenging and such. So, uh, initially, uh, I was going to get it, but what really sealed the deal was the final sentence in this. However, the dungeons have been upgraded to be truly challenging, even to a Zelda Master. It's a call to action. So, expect a live stream after... After Skyward Sword, I'm going to do a live stream of the Ocarina of Time Master Quest. I'm going to play, I'm going to stream that version. Um, and I should be prepared to do Wind Waker's hero mode. And then there's Twilight Princess. And yeah, I'm looking forward to doing that. But yeah, so that, if you want to like my personal, like, uh, I guess. Where's the other? If you, want my, if you want my personal suggestion from a site to get it from, get it from Luki Games. A lot of the games they have, they're in good condition. I've ordered some of their games in the past. In fact, let me see if I can pull up my list. The list of games I bought. Uh, I don't Yeah, I've got Perfect Dark and Metroid Prime 2. They were in good condition. Uh, Pokemon Snap. Uh, got that one in good condition. Uh, this one? $15. Oh, yeah, it was like $13, uh, $14 for Tomb Raider for PlayStation 1. $37. I got a memory card? Wait, why did I get, why did I get myself a memory card? Huh. I think I have it somewhere in my room, I don't know. Uh but yeah, like a lot of their games are at really good prices. They also sell certain accessories. I've got my hands on the Nintendo 64's like power power glove. Um so yeah, I I totally recommend. Um, and they also have like a point system, in which you can redeem points and you can get games. I don't know if they switch the lists around from time to time. Uh, let me see if I can actually show.
so yeah, like I, if, if I gather enough, if I gather up enough points, I could get a cart, the cartridge for the Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars, the cartridge. I'm not close, but like, that that's a goal. That's a goal. I think depending on how much you spend, uh, depends on how many points you get. Uh, let me go. To, let me just go to one of these games. Actually, let me go to one of the games on my wish list. I want to get my hands on. Uh, yeah, let's go Sonic Lost World. That's that's one game I don't have. Uh, so yeah, let me. So. Okay, I'm just thinking. Um, so, yeah, like, so the game is, like, $43, and it says here, 43 Luki points will be rewarded to you when you buy this. That's basically how you do the point system. Um. Hey, this is just my current wish list. This is just a wish list, obviously. Uh, games I want to try to get my hands on. I don't have le any these two Zelda games yet. Technically, I have Link's Awakening, but it's on the, the little Game & Watch thing. Um, and so many others. It's like... I, I recommend it. And they also sell, like, consoles, too. So you can you can get your hands on, like, a 64 or a NES. I'm back. Sorry. But yeah, uh, Luki Games, I I recommend it. It's a good, good site. Good site and all. Good customer service, too. Although, the problem I'm having is not being solved anytime soon. <laughs> Let's see what else they have that I might want to add to the list. Uh, for my wish, for my wish list. Um. Oh yeah. Um. I hate to say it, but don't expect any like. Don't expect a video out today. Uh. 
I stayed up too late last night to really do anything. That night I had spent like the entire day watching videos and such. And I was also testing the, the games I got, so that's Yeah. <laughs> uh I feel like it resonated. I don't know what's up with me. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm feeling kind of RPG for whatever reason. <laughs> um, it's like, <clears throat> what is that? Um, I don't know. I just feel like playing an RPG, something like Paper Mario. Actually, there are like three RPGs in the Mario series that I'm gonna stream at some point. Well, another one is picking up. Um. I wanna, I wanna replay Final Fantasy VII. Um, I haven't beat it, uh, so, but so I'm just gonna be like, uh, playing through the game. Like just starting over from where I, from where I was at and going forward from there. Um. I with with how. I've, been, I, I've watched some other people do some RPGs. I watched, well, quote unquote, watched Dan play Thousand Year Door on Game Grumps. Uh, but that is a series. Um, and I was like, oh, you know, I could probably do something like that. Uh, I actually played, um, I played the, some of the Mario and Luigi games on my own, but those games I wouldn't mind playing again. <clears throat> What's another one? Uh, oh, oh, actually, I'm gonna wait till my co-host shows up because I wanna, I wanna talk to, I wanna talk about something. Um, um I don't really have to like. Some PlayStation games I don't have to worry about. I've got PlayStation Plus. Um, you know what? I should, I should probably get Sonic Rush. Like that is a game I have not played in a long time. It that is like my. That is like my freaking childhood there. You know what? Might, might as well go ahead and add, um... Might as well go ahead and... Oh, it's out of stock! Put me on the waiting list. Good thing I don't have this thing now. I, if they don't have like the wish list option, I, I just want to add this to my wish list. Darn it! Ah, uh, man, I wanna, I wanna play that game again. Oh, there's a lot of these that I wanna watch. What? There's a lot of these I wanna play. Oh man, I do plan on playing like another Sonic game. Uh, actually, I think. Sonic Adventure is going to be one I'm going to be playing. Um, yeah, that'll that will replace Sniper Elite, I think. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. If there was like something else I was wanting to swap out, or uh, like a game I want to uh, I want to play in in. Um, In response to no longer playing Sniper Elite. Um,
Okay, sorry about that. I'm back. Uh, I guess I can just go to web... The web o -cam. Uh, actually, I'm gonna stay right back. I'm gonna go grab one other thing. Felt like I need to grab my hat, you know. Uh, yeah. Sorry, sorry if I'm not really uh, saying anything else at all. Just actually kind of looking through this list to see if I can find something to add. Excuse me. Excuse me. Do do. Chill first. Have my headphones on so that I can hear my my co-host. I'll also continue to look for some for some games. Thought about thought about Banjo Tooie, but should probably finish playing the first game before I contemplate whether or not I want to get the sequel. I heard the sequel is good and all. However, I must I must form an opinion for myself. Uh... Sorry. So I'm yawning a lot. It's just, yeah. <laughs> I can't really, I can't really explain it. Why I'm yawning so much? Uh... I, think I have Crash Team. Right? Do I have Crash Bash? My suitcase of games is over there. I'm not going to bother, but I'm, I'm, I'm just, just going to sit here and, and wait. Oh, bother! Killer Instinct. Uh, Crash Twin Sanity. I should get Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, I could probably just get Sonic 3 and Knuckles. You get Halo's to collectors of it. Wait, what exactly is this? Oh, like the collector's edition <laughs> for the original Xbox, which I have. I think mean, I already have Halo 2, so I don't, I don't, I don't think I need to worry. Uh... I don't have the first Castlevania game. Mario Party 3. No, it's just regular Mario Party. I'm adding Mario Party to the 
the good old good old uh wish list. Like I, I kinda wish I could pay, I can buy all of this, like right now, but at the same time I can't spend too much money. Tis the problem in real life. Oh, I want to get Pikmin. Oh, that's right. That's... Oh, hey. I'm sorry, I'm late. It's okay. I, I got held I... up. Oh, I understand the need for food and consumption. Oh my God, did I miss anything? No, I've just been sitting here talking to anyone who is in the chat right now, talking about getting games. Uh. Mm. Let me go ahead and see. add all this stuff to my wish list. So, uh, ah, my wish list is a PS5, so I can play that new Star Wars game. <laughs> oh, my... hang on, I'll, I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> uh, he's here for a moment, and then all of a sudden, poof, done with the wind. Uh, so yeah, my co-host is here. That's just $143? Luki Games is tempting me with this. I, you know what? I guess I don't really need to worry about... I mean... Uh, com uh, compared to what? Compared to what? Super Mario... That's another 7 stars. Shopping. Summer. Okay, it's from Summer with a complete set. I'm pretty sure that's just a repro. Like an authentic. 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 That's a hundred dollars for some places. What? I don't know. If, I don't know if saying the same sentence at the same time would do, do anything different, Zelda. What? <laughs> Authentic. I don't think saying it different ways will make it will change a thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh... Okay. I think that's all I'm gonna be doing to add to my wish list. I got some food. emails. Emails. Anyways, all right. Uh. Do I have... Do I have this set to... Nope, wander off. Okay. Are you able to see the game? I am see it completely. Nice. It's in HD. Yes! Perfect! Let me... Okay, yeah. I've got my Can't notes. wait the voice. Yes! In which case were we on again? The one with Old Bag? Yes! Uh, the last okay. time, I think we got through the we got through day one trial, which they pushed it back to the next day in the morning. So we have this entire day to investigate, find more information. One such information was that there was someone else that managed to get into the studio set, which Old Bag did not tell us about. That could be a key witness for us in this case. So, I'm just in it just to voice Miles again. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Yep. Okay, so you're voicing Maya and Phoenix. Yeah, and I think I got the judge too. Alright. Uh. <clears throat> Ooh, what a day. This is no time for relaxing, Nick. Say, you think WP's got a chance? I guess it really depends on the people we found out about in today's trial. The director and producer. Yeah, them. Well, what are we doing here then? Let's get to let's get to the studios. All right. <laughs> what do you think we should do? What do I? Huh? Why don't we do what you just said? We gotta get the scoop on this director and producer. All right, then there's no point in hanging out here. That's what I've been saying. Let's get to the studio pronto. 
I don't know. I want to think maybe I'm doing some voice as well. Like, I've got one for Fi when I'm doing... Hey, whatever I'm doing, like, her voice is such for the Skyward Sword stream. Um, is, it, is, out, is Fi supposed to be demonic? <laughs> <laughs> is it that bad? <laughs> It was it was low voice. It was low pitch, like low reverb. Oh my god! I just noticed something on the stream. <laughs> <laughs> like, like I was like, I was like, oh, Skyward Sword Five. Let's see, how's the voice call? And also, I just hear get Scarlet Pink on the SCP universe. <laughs> I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> I was like, is this wait? Do you get the mice wrong? Or is this Five? <laughs> I don't know, imagine like this is like this is like reverse like the re like reverse Pika from One Piece. <laughs> oh, so it's like it's either that. What am I grab? Oh, it's like the it's like the most buff dude, but most squeaky voice. <laughs> but it's like the most like puniest looking character with the most deepest voice ever. Uh. <laughs> You should have you should have heard her voice when I first started the stream. It was like close to the voice I did for Iona's. And oh. <laughs> it was really weird. We don't have enough information to make a case yet. That's exactly the same thing you said yesterday. Just admit it. You don't have a clue what happened. It's not enough information. Ah, right, cool. God damn it, Milo. <laughs> You're not helping. Let's go to the detention center. Willpower. Oh boy, me. Yeah! <laughs> he looks like Lysander. <laughs> it's like Lysander if he fell off. Yeah. Oh, it's alright. Thank you for earlier. Not at all. We got lucky to tell the truth. You can say that again. Let's not. So WP, do you have any leads that might get us going in the right direction? Hmm. Sorry, but no. Be sure to tell us anything that comes to mind, no matter how small. We can't rely on getting lucky again tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> I just imagine it's like if they were. I, I, I don't know if my sniff got like caught onto my mic, but I did try to do the sniff <laughs> like sniffle thing. It's just, it's just like, <laughs> it's just, it's like, I uh, no, like, uh, you want to turn up your, you might have to do it a little bit louder. Okay. How's, how's that? A little bit louder. Uh, how's that? Ah, oh, I can't go a little bit louder. Okay. It's like... <laughs> oh, also, I didn't mention this, but on my side, we're doing the stream. I've got, like, two audio, like, mixers. Uh, One oh. to capture, oh. like, you know, the output and such. Your voice was caught on both my broadcast stream mix, which is what my GoXLR is, and the only audio output, so there's a bit of double audio that happened. Oh, damn. Surround sound. Hell yeah. <laughs> uh, do uh, fanboys sneak into the studio often? I know of. Sure, that was pretty strict with them. <laughs> okay, so now it's like a slow rise to hear your voice. Wait, wait. Is my voice not picking up? No, it, I, your voice is picking up, but like when you start it, it's small and then it's like slowly increases in volume, and then you're you're speaking perfectly. Oh, it's like automatic. I think my noise. I think it's my stuff. Oh. Uh, but because I have like a bunch of like I have like echo cancellation, automatic. Ah, uh, here it is. Automatic gain control. Mm, okay, I, I guess that makes sense. Uh, advanced voice activity. I'll, I don't know if I want to do echo cancel it. You know what? Uh, testing, testing. How is it now? Because I turned off game control. It sounds nice. It sounds good. Alright. Uh, but, but in today's testimony, didn't she say they were often hanging around? The kids really, really love to steal samurai. They sneak past when she's not looking, I guess. Is that better? Yeah, that was a lot. That was better. Was the director present at the morning run-through? Yes. Yes, he was. He is directing how the steel samurai and the evil magistrate should move. Why didn't you tell us before? Tell us that before? Well, th just the studio asked us to keep quiet. Uh, I, uh, sorry. <laughs> that has nothing to do with this. 
I hate to repeat myself, but Nick here is the newbie lawyer, fresh off the bar. When he loses, he's gonna lose big. I don't think that's a. I don't think that's a good way. I don't think that's a good pitch to your <laughs> <fucking defense. laughs> That's exactly. It's like if we lose because you actually killed someone, it's gonna be a big loss to to write. We all know what happened to Amber Heard. Let's not end up. <laughs> TMZ did not make it better when they tried to pull one of their guys out. Oh my god. <laughs> I should have expected. Uh, did we make like did we make like a jab at the Amber Heard case last time or <laughs> I don't think we did. But from what I think I, I don't know if I mentioned this, but did you know they were making a fucking docu like drama about Yes, it? I think I also heard Amber said she was gonna make a book or something. <laughs> Making a book? I, it's like, uh, that's rumor. It's like, uh, take it with a grain of salt. It's like, what good is it gonna do? Uh, I don't know. But uh, again, it's rumor. It's like, I don't have all the information. I do not have to look into the drama stuff. Vin Diesel made a book and it was only just one word. Family. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the subject of all his D&D games. Family. It's just Oh, all right. I forgot he's a fucking major hot D and D fan. <laughs> you are. <laughs> Calm down. But I can't Calm help down. it. Uh. You aren't hiding anything else from us, are you? No, I, I sure hope not. A dog stepped on a a bee. <laughs> <laughs> Old back stepped on a, a feet. does not mod have a trial like that. No, oh I think I think someone did. I think someone did actually mod the game to have that case. Hold on. Just take the entire code. I'm right. gonna look for it. Yes. Okay. I think. This yeah, this is the video. <laughs> There's the video. I'm gonna send it on oh. the Discord. Okay, cool. A freaking Google. Just send me like a, a, a Google link instead of a YouTube Spaghetti link. Spaghetti code. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay, never mind. I guess it's just like fan art of it. So they, <laughs> they replaced the character. Oh, they didn't replace Friends. any of the models. <laughs> French baguette intelligence. <laughs> baguette intelligence. Oh, it's so oh good. My God. <laughs> Your Honor, clean. I like the I like the thumbnail. Your Honor, cleaning this wound is insane. <laughs> I thought the thumbnail was. Oh, I, might have, I might have got the wrong video. I think I might have got the. Well, yeah, it's like. <laughs> it's so good. It's still worse. It's still funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Uh, anyway, right. Come to the main place. <laughs> uh, okay. <clears throat> no one's here. Right now, right now they have Miss Oldbag in custody. I guess they don't have anyone else to replace her. Hey, it's the guard station. Look, she left her donuts. What? I wasn't gonna eat them. Sure, Maya, sure. Sure. Yeah. Comes Ooh. like next next scene. She comes she has a box of them. <laughs> <laughs> that that probably sounds like something she would do in the anime. It's like when she actually points out the donuts, like Phoenix just walks off to a different area, then she follows up holding on to the box and eating on one. I think there was one scene where I remember where she got stuck or something, I don't remember. Oh yeah. Oh uh, sorry. <laughs> Look, it's an assistant girl. Hey! Hi, WP's war lawyers, right? Who's who was gonna do Penny? Was it me or you? I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'll do, heard... I'll do the director. I'll okay. do the director. Okay, I heard about the trial. Great job, guys. Oh. Oh, oh. don't mention it. 
Is it true they caught the security lady? Oh, 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 ho. what? What is he doing? What? What kind of? I don't even remember play. I don't think I remember this when I played through it. <laughs> Actually, she just called me. She told me to cover up that drain. You mean that one? I just got car. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> what, what great handiwork that. Nice. Is. Totally. It's like. <laughs> Wow, what a mess. Cardboard, I could just wash it down with a water gun. You could just kick on it from the other side. I, I know. I'm not so good with handiwork. Some assistant, right? Yeah, but you do work the props and the backdrops, right? Right. Just lots of times they end up looking worse than they did before I fixed them. Oh. Oh? Well, I'm sure these things happen. Nothing to worry yourself about. Penny's model looks like some sort of, like, generic, like, intern for, like, a reporter. Yeah, she looks like the- she closely resembles the girl from, uh, Pokemon Scarlet, you know, the one with the Eevee backpack. Oh, right. Okay, cool. Is, like, is it, like, I, don't, I think I remember her. Yeah, I think I called- a while ago. I think I nicknamed that girl Penny. Because Cassiopeia- I think her name is- I think her name is Penny. She's <laughs> the one- is that just the one the Coridon just like the like, messed with her, didn't it? I think. Hold on, let me look. Pokemon Scarlet. Yeah, there it is. Uh, duh, 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 duh. this guy be in that. Is, is that her name had to be Penny? Had to been Penny because I remember. What was it? Was it Penny? It is Penny. <laughs> <laughs> her name is Penny. <laughs> wow. <laughs> It's, it's, this game was released like six, like eight years ago, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Either we're really smart or we're really stupid that we forgot. Oh my god. Uh, and of course we can't forget Melis. We like did like a little collab like this anyway. <laughs> also we can't forget Melis awesome boots in <laughs> <laughs> walking. <laughs> soldier like nut like soldier walking down. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Oh, I God, we died laughing at that part. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, oh my God. God! I'm supposed to fill in for this one. <laughs> We're supposed to voice this, but can we can't <laughs> keep away the dumbest shit ever. Ah, <laughs> uh, good luck with your investigation. Okay. Oh God. Oh my God. Right, let's look at let's look at the fucking gray. Bicycle. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get one of the electric powered bicycles. I don't know about these. I mean, what's the point? It makes it a lot easier to go uphill. Don't people cycle to get exercise? Oh, you little faith. So, the fanboy they were talking about today in the trial today, he came into that drain? So it seems. I guess they covered it up in a hurry. Hey, hey Nick. If that drain's covered, the boy won't be able to get in. Uh, yeah, I think that was the idea. I feel kind of sorry for him, though, don't you? I don't like the look on her face. <laughs> <laughs> what, you want to rip- what, you want to rip the grade off? Really, Nick? We can? Whoa, she's serious? Uh-oh. I knew it! Oh, God. I think Fuck we have it. to, yeah. YOLO. Well, I guess some things are just made to be broken. Oh, I- He's <laughs> not around. <laughs> Yay! You know, Nick, you're pretty small sometimes. Sometime? <laughs> There, that should make the kids happy. Things we do. I'm pretty sure that's obstruction. I'm pretty sure that's like obstruction of like investigation or something like that. No, I don't think so. It's like, it's like obstruction of justice would be like you getting in the way of FBI and such. Um, and cops probably. Yeah. Yeah, and this isn't like a crime scene, so it's not like a case of oh you're contaminating the crime scene or you're altering the crime scene. Well, th so. Yeah, technically this is this is, at, this is around. This is near the crime scene, but not at the, not a crime scene. Yeah. <laughs> now the kids will be able to come in again. Doesn't it make you feel great to do a good deed like that? Must Reverse be must... Robin Hood. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. Slide to the right. <laughs> Door to the dressing room is not locked. Hey Nick, let's go in. Maybe there'll be something else to steal. Hey! Huh? Not... Hey yo! Hey yo! <laughs> But we did take that car key. We borrowed that. There's a difference. Uh, let's see what 
do crabs. Oh crap, that's not it. Uh, what was the button again? All right, I had to right click. It was move. Just a move. Yeah, I'm having to right. I had to right click in order to go back. This... Uh, hold on a second. I'm right back, guys. So chat, you hear a billion crabs went missing? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, wait, hang on. No, it was it was not it was not a billion. It was eleven billion crabs. Do do do.
so, right? Yeah, it's... <laughs> he comes over from time to time and... I don't want him to make a curious reflex. Okay, back to the video. Okay. That's what Mr. Powers says, at least. I guess they snuck in and took him while he was sleeping. Oh. Uh, Nick, what if Mr. Powers hadn't been sleeping? I wonder what the killer was planning on doing then. Huh. He's got a point. I don't really think there's anything else of interest, but we are gonna have to keep this place. We're gonna come back to this later. I say we head to one of the studios. Yep. Oh, hey! Oh, oh Jesus. <laughs> oh, you look a lot out of place. It's the clothes, isn't it? I thought my camo vest might do the trick. <laughs> That's not a camo That's as hell. That looks. That's literally the opposite. What can you blend in into this scenario? The van. See the wall on the left, or the or or the van on the right. <laughs> Just hide behind a tree. <laughs> kind of an alternative guard fashion thing. Yeah, I don't know. If there's really. Oh, there's still more stuff to talk to her about. So how is the studios doing? There's police wandering on everywhere. It's terrible. They won't even let me clean up. They don't want me disturbing evidence. I haven't even cleaned. <laughs> Played on the day of the murder. The crap. You know damn well those smell bad. Yeah. Let me get some. Oh, I thought I had tape stuck to me. Do I have tape stuck to me? Is that my skin? <laughs> Is that your skin? Peel it off. <laughs> I'm good. It's just something feels weird. Oh well. Uh. <laughs> you mean those places with the steak bones left over on them in the employee area? Yeah. Can you believe it? That must be evidence. <laughs> Do kids sneak in here a lot? Well, I don't think there's that many of them, but I do see one in particular a bunch. He's always gawking at the sets or snapping pictures. You should see old windbag's eyes flash when she sees him. She has a bit of trouble catching him, though. I heard something at the trial today. They said that the director and producer were here the day of the murder. Oh, sorry. I was in the prop storage room, so I didn't see them. I guess they were here, though. Studio heads seem pretty eager to keep us quiet. So they were trying to protect the director? More the producer, really. The producer's our real star here. She saved these studios from the brink of disaster and kept them running. I don't think we'd still be in She's business. She's the killer. I think, I think th that's the killer. Yeah. I feel like the producer's is the killer. <laughs> Spoiler alert, everyone! <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> I, no, do you think about it? If it's the if it's the if the director's gonna be the killer, why would the hell would he kill his star? It has to be the producer. Yeah. It's always the producer. <laughs> I see so many cops here, it has to be the producer. Yeah. Hey Nick. This is technically a sport, this is a theory. <laughs> a game theory, not sponsored by the way. <laughs> we get sponsored by game theory. <laughs> That sounds like a, that's a big stretch. You think about it. Getting sponsored by a channel. Oh my god! This video, this video is sponsored in part by Game Theory. Go check out their recent shorts, like Link is Dead and Majora's Mask. Oh my gosh! That's yeah, a oh. big theory they did, huh? Oh, it's like they they made a short talking about it, and it's just basically like a dialed down version of a video they did make about Link. About that theory. I know, I know, I know. They, I've seen the original video. I didn't think they make it <laughs> short, but then again, that's yeah, way. you can put you can put a lot of information in just a minute. Oh yeah, it's probably up to his naked paperwork after the commotion of today's trial. So Nick, I was just out of the box. Remember that Studio Two we heard about at the trial today? It was down that path of the fallen tree, right? Yeah, I think that's what they said. Maybe the director and the rest of them are here today. Now's our chance, Nick. Let's check it out. Okay. Let's trespass. Let's go to Studio One. Yeah. <laughs> uh, man, man, I'm dead. Yeah. <laughs> Bruh, I'm dead. I Just like. <laughs> want to be. <laughs> yeah, it is a murder scene. I want to go someplace else, Nick. Uh... So this dead body here on the ground. <laughs> They outlined where Jack Hammer's body lay was taken. His body was found inside the evil magistrate costume. I guess that's what they. Why would Why would they need to like outline the entire, the entire suit? Why did you just do just the body and that's it? 
Well, I guess if there's this, like, you know, oh, there's a tear here, and it was torn when it, like, well, the body was laying there. So that... Yeah. Look at the headpiece. I know. The entire samurai helmet. <laughs> oh my goodness. Funny, <laughs> oh, yeah, I expected a spear stabbing wound would leave a, at least a few blood stains. I guess the custom must have absorbed most of it. Yeah. Court records, by the way? The, uh. The dude? No, it wasn't. Chef has been I keep on forgetting. I played I played Dual Destiny from Spirit of Justice. I'm so used to their new like 3D model of objects. My gosh, freaking Edgeworth is 24 years old. How old is Nick? Uh, I don't. I think it was 22, wasn't he? I think so. God, no, it was same age. <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> Wait. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> oh my god. We don't know her age. Yeah. <laughs> but the existential dread I'm going through is like, my gosh, if they're 20, they're 24 years old, I'm 22. I'm not, I don't look anything near these guys. 17, 17 30. Will Powers is an age old. You're the same age as him. No shot, he's 23. He looks, he looks bigger. He, like, he looks older. He looks bigger. <laughs> <laughs> he looks bigger. Oh my god. I, it's like, I Come can't. On. He's 37? He's 37, yes. <laughs> he's bigger than, ja than Will Powers. Oh my god. My goodness. This game. Japan in there. <laughs> Don't do it. That's what I'm wondering. I think it was like 30, 32. 30. Oh, it's 30. No shot. He looks younger than... He looks younger than fucking... <laughs> he looks. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's go outside. Studio 2. Studio 2. <laughs> this place is deserted. Crash! It's not deserted anymore. Nick! What was that noise? It sounded like it came from inside the trailer. Someone must be inside. Hello? No answer. Yeah. Pretty suspicious. <laughs> Pretty sure <it's> obvious. <laughs> Let's go in. I'm not sure we should be barging in. Huh? It's locked. What? Do we have a key? No. We have a card key. It's not the same thing. But there's probably one of the guard station at the main gate. What are we waiting for? Let's borrow it! If they'll let us. You immediately just say, let's borrow it. And the, like, and, I, like the, I like the music just abruptly. Exactly, <laughs> I was about to say the same thing. <clears throat> um. Examine. Computer. Looks like it's been turned off for the day. Alright, that's a bit sus. Computer, computer. Don't touch anything. Security lady would not stop in on me if she knew. I really want the key to the trailer. Maybe next time. No head map of the studio. Right here is the employee to the left of the actual film studios. I wonder if the employee area has like the key. Probably. I think we actually had to go there. Let's go back to the lofts. <laughs> Maybe we'll find what we're looking for there. And we're gonna go into the dressing room, and then... Yep! What the fr- <laughs> <That's it. laughs> What is this? I think I'll do this guy. <laughs> do this. I'll, do, I'll do this voice. This sounds amazing. What the fr- kind of language is this? Oh god, I'm so old. Is this leech? Is this like- Wait, is this the beginning of leech speak? I think so! <laughs> go ahead. WGF, who the, who are you dudes? Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh god, it's one of these guys. I played the pixelated version, so I don't remember. It's <laughs> <laughs> really smooth. Uh. Huh? Wait. Wait, you first. Who are you? You look pretty suspicious to me. 
Oh my what god, he's boomers. he is speaking in leap speak. Oh god. He looks like a generic, um, well, he looks like a generic, uh, well, off-brand yeah. type of genre <laughs> character. Oh, his name is Salmonella. Oh, perfect. How can you not know the great Salmonella? I never got it, so, like, you know. Oh my god, it is Lee Speak. Oh my god, he's... Oh god, I just remembered now. He's the director! Oh, fuck. I, I remember him vividly. Uh... No, no. Well, I really. It's fine, our boy. Oh, boy. Oh, the boy. oh my god. Uh, it's like. Have you ever seen Superman, Batman, uh, Public Enemies? Not yet, I don't think. It's been a while. There is a character named Toymaker, whose name is Hero. And <laughs> it's... He's not as bad as this guy, but he made some x-ray goggles once, and uh, he was in the same room as Power Girl, and then... Well... Oh, God. Hang on, I'm gonna <laughs> just uh, look that up real quick. <laughs> <laughs> I think another thing is that Hero... The Hero in... Public Enemies is who Hero is in Big T Big Hero 6. I think, oh, really? I think that's the news. Oh, I think that's one of the informations about that character. That's <clears throat> neat. Yeah, I can see it too. You know, on closer inspection... Oh god, how, clo well, how close of an inspection are you talking about? Well, I've seen the anime. So oh! <laughs> Voice this guy anymore. Raw cosplay because that costume rocks. Rocks. I'm not, I'm not doing the. I'm not doing the jewel. I get no rock sword. Rock sword. God, what is this? Oh god, I just remember she also transforms. You trigger my creative powers! Creative powers, huh? Gosh, I wonder what kind of creative powers. He's speaking to me. Pink Princess! He's speaking normal. The sequel to Steel Samurai, Pink Princess, Warrior to, of Little Old Tokyo. It's completely different from what I saw in okay. the anime. <laughs> Wait, have you only watched the anime? I see. I played through the game, then watched the anime. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I think you mentioned. That. <laughs> Is it gonna be Little Old Tokyo? Why can't it have a cool name like Neo Old Tokyo? I oh, yeah, we really need to talk about cool. Did you notice anything unusual on the day of the murder? Oh, I know who you dudes are. <coughs> Fury told you about us, huh? He's Canadian. He says, hey. <laughs> uh, that's right. I think I'm gonna just speak normally. I don't want to speak like. I'll, I'll, I'll do the like the low pitch voice like this. Yeah. But I'm not gonna like do his like lead speech. Yeah, no, that's like this. <laughs> it was a pretty regular day. We had a run through for the action scene in the morning. Then a meeting from lunchtime from in the Studio Two trailer. <clears throat> I was so busy I didn't even get a chance to eat lunch. What the fuck? <laughs> he vocalized the steady face. Uh, a T-bone yeah. steak, was it? Yeah, suckers. I hate missing out on food. Uh, okay. What? Nick, what does suckers, suckers mean? <laughs> no idea. I, I, I want to think it's, it's saying like... I don't know what he's. I don't know how he's trying to say them, but I yeah. legit thought he meant suckers. I don't mean like, like legitimately suckers. Yeah. Anyway, I was in a meeting from noon until till after four. What? Apparently, the game. Apparently, this game was released on the Game Boy Advance. 
Well, Game Boy Advance in Japan. Huh. Yeah, th okay, so for those of you oh, wondering, wow. this game was released in 2001, and he's speaking in elite speak. Oh. <sighs> oh, crap, I need to take notes. What the fuck? Uh, it was like um, from noon till four, to until four to noon till af till after four. Yo, queen. I've seen so many horror movies like saw like saw trained me to find out who the killer is. Knives Out is not a good movie. Oh, yeah. <sighs> as soon as I saw... As soon as I saw the guy... Uh, as soon as... I didn't even say anything. I didn't even... Like, in the first few seconds of the movie, that's like... Looks like a suicide. <laughs> <laughs> Still in the truth, that meeting gives him an alibi. About the producer who was at the meeting with you. Oh, you mean D. Vasquez? That's a bad name. She's a genius. Mad skills all the way. Here we go. What's her name supposed to be a play on word of? Like, there's April May, who's, you know, the play on word of the month. And there's Mr. Red White of Blue Corp. And then we have this guy here. So what? Salmonella. Yeah, so what's, what's the Vasquez supposed to be a play on word of? The Vasquez. She brought back these studios from the brink of destruction. She's the one who made it possible for me to make the steel samurai. You had a meeting with her on the other day of the murder, right? Yeah. We were together from noon to 4 p.m. Okay, the whole time. So it is noon to 4. I, I, got, I had it backwards for some reason. Uh, let me take a look. Noon would be like 12, right? So it takes between, yeah, noon is 12, and up, so noon is 12. Yeah. So it happened, this this happened two hours. Let's like see. in between their talking time, like in straight, directly in the middle, actually. Yeah, let's see. The time of death was 2.30. Uh, one person went from between, between 1 to 2.30. So, meeting in Studio 2, yeah, that was blue. Okay, so, this person was likely on their way to the studio. Who exactly are these big wigs people keep mentioning? Oh, the boss over the network, some sponsors, and a few production guys. Oh, okay, now the background music is like this. He powered into a limousine and got here right around noon. Major tension. Were all of them with you the entire time? Yeah, unfortunately. They're all gray-haired geezers. But you also have gray hairs. Hmm, sounds like they'd all be reliable witnesses. Okay. Makes sense. Uh, okay, I guess... We're... Hang on, court record, court record. Check the court record for the uh, for the profiles now. Since we ne since we met this guy, we now be able to find out what his age is. Thirty. No. <sighs> oh, goodness. Uh, actually, let me see if I can. I think we might have to present. Oh, I hate you. I try not to pay much attention to things that don't interest me. Low. It's a weapon from your series. Uh, why do you not? Why are you not? Why are you not interested? Oh! Oh God! That oh, is. Oh hell no! Nah. <laughs> oh, well. Through this trial, I... <laughs> through this trial. Yeah. <laughs> God. Oh, okay. How about this? Ah! Yeah. How do you how do you know? Well look, he's obviously dragging his foot. Alright, the director would know about the injury. He was there. Okay. 
Oh, no. Oh, my God, oh, God. That's, uh, okay, we got to like, run. Run. We got to get We need to get the crap out of here. We're getting the hell out of here. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Let me, let me slide to the left. Nothing. Okay. Let's look. Let's look at it again. So, because I'm pretty sure you didn't look. Did you look at it before? Okay, we did. Yeah. I was expecting to see something. Okay. Ooh, Ben. I don't think it would fit if I tried to put it back on. Great going, Maya. Someone's forklift certified. <laughs> Anyways, um. All right, back to the, back to the main gate, I guess. Oh God, oh, she's here. <laughs> we did. Dick. You acting like you've seen a ghost. You basically are a ghost. You certainly got back to your post quickly. The police took me away, they did. They pulled out a spare steel samurai costume. Told me to put it on. Can you imagine? Uh, I'm pretty sure it looked a lot better. How could I, a sweet little old lady, wear a suit like that? Mr. Powers is pretty tall. And he's I think they saw there was no way I could wear They let me go. I guess that would rule out her being the murderer. Anyway, okay, that was fast. Yeah. No, no it is, whippersnapper. An old lady never forgets the slide or insult. And you won't get any information out of me. My lips are sealed. You sure are talking a lot for someone with sealed lips. Starting now. One, two, three. Hmm. This lady's too much. So, hey, the fanboy. Uh, about that kid you said you saw. If I see him again, I'm picking him down. Well, she broke her promise. <laughs> Nick, look at her eyes. She's serious. Did I... I actually like, pressed the button. Oh, God. Yeah, I just... Oh, crap. My mouse was being sensitive. Uh, about the director, the one who was here on the day of the murder. If I see him again, I'm taking him down. Wait, what the hell? And I think she's losing it. Well, guys, right. we won. We broke here. <laughs> uh, I don't think there's anything we can really. Uh, let's try, let's move back to the studio. Well, okay. basically, my outside studio one. Yeah. Uh, let's go studio inside. two again. Actually, let's go. To, actually, it's been a while since we went since the commotion happened. Actually, yeah, two, that's right. Slide to the right. Let's go to the door. The trailer door. It's locked. He is probably in the security guard station. I thought they'd let us borrow it. Alright. Alright, time to break the window. Closer inspection. This trailer looks like it's been here for a while. I don't think this is That's part a of the trailer. Temporary film. Yeah. I guess that might be a trailer in like Japanese in the Japanese like I don't film know. community. What's can we go inside the... What about the gate? There's some flowers here. Wow, so pretty. They're taking good care of these. Don't get too close. That fence looks dangerous. Why, wait, hold on. Why is one of them bent? Why is one of them bent? That is rather weird. These old materials are making a movie set. I've been sitting here for quite some time. Can you talk about the fact that they were panicking about a bump in the trailer, and now there's, like, a <laughs> shield now? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Something about us has died. Let's go get the key. And then come back with, like, a bag of popcorn. It's like, man, that movie was amazing. <laughs> exactly. An incinerator. Apparently, they just put this one in. It's already covered in soot. They must not clean it much. A light van for moving staff and equipment around. It's kept it in pretty good shape. Looks like it's been. Looks like it's run fine. Well, let's go for a drive. Sure, if I had a license. Excuse Nick, me, Nick. You don't have a driver's license? But look, I have this. Why are you showing me your attorney's badge, Nick? Damn. <laughs> looks like two people ate here. There's nothing left in the plates. Hey, so they ate T-bone steaks too. What is it with with the, what is it with steaks around here? Hey, there's always room for steak. But something does seem out of place. What? I 
don't know. I just feel odd. Let's look at the plates. Hmm. They're both there. Hmm. Well, they did say there was supposed to be a bunch of like produce like a bunch of big wigs. Yeah. Well, it makes sense for them to just be one, like two plates. Yeah, so two people met here at some point. Uh, like the fact that it's in the middle of nowhere, like just in the middle of the entire lot. Yeah. Just eating. Uh, uh, let's go. Let's go look at the uh, guard station. Let's see what she reacts. Oh yeah. Oh hey, uh, text mark. See the computer that was cute again. Hey, don't touch him. Guess I'd better investigate there later. You could have had a chance, you know, when Penny was around. Oh, wait. I got an idea. What's that? Studio, let's go back to the employee area. Maybe something will happen, because... We, maybe hey! Gonna, uh, <laughs> hey! Hey, wait! I bet he came in right through that drain. Hey, um, kitty O. What's your name, sport? Wow. What? Who I don't should I do the voice for this? I should, I should probably do it. Yeah. Hey! I'm not as good. No, that's not something like a fucking voice. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you was gonna do like some Mario voice for a second. I'm like, hold on a second. I, I thought it sounded like more like the old bag. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, I got okay, I gotta find a good voice for this one. Uh okay. I'm not a kid! Don't talk to me like that! I don't know why I'm doing this. <laughs> <laughs> huh? But you're you're a kid. What a brutal little brat. That's no way to talk to an adult. Maya, you're 17 years old. I don't think you. Can't be fashion, chick. Oh my god, this kid Can't got be fashion. Worse. Nick, I think I'm being mocked. I gotta hand it to Maya. She's pretty sharp and pretty mad. I'm Cody. Cody Hackett. I don't know if I should want to do the voice. You probably, you should probably do the voice. Okay. Anyways. Call me Keo again, and I'll cut you down where you stand, evil doer. Alright, cool. So you're been to the Steel Samurai? How dare you under that name, evil doer? What do you mean? We're on the Steel Samurai side. Ha, ha, ha! You can't fool me. Okay. Then what's the last line said to the innkeeper in Episode Eight? Ha! Easy. Like some fries with that? Hmm. Not bad, Kidio. Watch it! What are they doing? We talk. <laughs> exactly. Say, you heard anything about the incident the other day? You were here, weren't you? Did you see anything? He... He... He always... The Steel Samurai always wins! Always! Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything! What? But... But no way am I telling you losers. What? Wait... Let me go! He's gone. Huh? Something fell off the table when he bumped into it on his way out. A uh, bottle? Why was this sitting there, I wonder? Empty bottle slipped into the pocket. Sleeping pill. Anyway, what was that kid saying? He saw everything. I think I remember in the anime, it's like, when Nick tries to go after the kid, he gets stuck into the ring, into the grate, and then Maya just pushes him downward. <laughs> oh, I think I might have seen that Oh no, I think it's when Maya was in like a, I don't know, a sewer or something. Uh, uh, Second season, the first season, though. Yeah. Oh, he ran off, so I guess he likely ran into... Yep. Huh? Where's that old windbag? I would have to leave her post. Hey! Nick, that was her! Whip the snapper! Yeah, sounds like she's chasing after that boy. Uh oh, she tripped! <laughs> Damn! Maya sure looks happy! She got her ankles broken. Let's get the key and run! Hey, hey, Nick! Now's our chance! Let's check out the guard station! Good idea. Oh, this is it, Nick. The trailer key. The key to the trailer in Studio 2. We'll be borrowing this, right, Nick? The trailer key slipped into the pocket. 
Yeah, it's just gonna need a oh, sleeping okay. pills. So oh, someone yeah. lays so sleeping pills. That's a that's that's one variable you have to know. Slide to the right. And okay, no. Yep. Examine. I wonder if the key we borrowed from the guard station will work. It's just uh, well, it, how would it, how would it not work? <laughs> exactly. Great, let's go, Nick. She sees eager all of a sudden. Yeah, like it, the tension kind of broke after like the scuffle happened. Then we we oh, yeah. then we saw Manila. Then that kid. Then went back and Penny. Was, was that was was that a pun? We saw Manila. <laughs> no, that wasn't intentional. Uh, well, hey, you... <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Trailer. Ooh. <laughs> it looks like I'm going to think that looks like Peter Griffith's nose or something. I'm like to say it looks somewhat <laughs> like Peter Griffith. <laughs> oh hi. Damn. S someone's in here. You want to do this? Um, one? Should, I do, should I do this voice for this one? I mean, you haven't really done a lot of the voices. You've only done Windbag Wind and Powers. Powers and Manella. The director. And I got. Got those three so Phoenix. far. And I had Phoenix, yes. Maya, the kid, and Penny. Yeah, this will make you. Actually, you're also doing Edgeworth. So yeah. that evens us out. Well, no, you had Gumshoe as well, didn't you? Did I? I think I did. Yeah, Gumshoe. Oh, okay. So, yeah, you need, yeah. Give it a, give it a shot, at least. Work. Names? Uh, our names? Uh, we're WP's lawyers, and, um... I see. <laughs> like, I kind of imagine that, like, she, of all the times that she's seen smoking that pipe, she has, like, a smoker's voice. I see. <laughs> uh, and who might you? Lee Vasquez. The producer. Yeah, it's just this line be like Dave Vasquez, the producer. Ah, oh, I I was watching the stream of Lethero and he he did smoker voice for Rouge. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Yeah, uh so Lethero and them play like DBFZ and they were doing a modded uh raid where they were fighting Sonic characters and they were playing oh, as no. Sonic characters, yeah. One of them they basically like they were basically team dark. I'd Heart Justice was Shadow, uh, Zysix underscore was Omega, and Lythero chose to be Rouge. But <laughs> oh boy, oh but, boy, yeah. But because they're doing like original lines and such, they're like they're making their own characters. And Lythero's character was that Rouge actually smokes and has a smoker voice, and Sega just put <laughs> some voice filter over her to make her sound sexy. <laughs> uh <-oh. laughs> it's so I bet when people play, like when kids played this game, they probably they probably went a woo guy at the Vasquez. <laughs> I figured and they would. Oh yes. Yeah, so... Oh, they're gonna be going a woo guy in a moment. Let me tell you. I was wondering if you could tell me about the day of the murder, Miss Vasquez. Conversation. <laughs> uh, can you try to repeat that line? Excuse me? Google script. A uh, script? The Steel Samurai, episode 13. I need it. Um, could we ask you a bit about the day of the murder? I need to read it. Jesus Christ. We're getting nowhere fast. Okay, let's see if... Um, we'd really like to ask you about the Steel Samurai. Miss Vasquez? It's on TV. Every week. That's all I have to say about that. Nick! She's telling us to go watch TV? The nerve of her! Hey, don't get mad. Still touch grass. <laughs> <laughs> about the director, Salmonella, was it? What er, exactly is his role here? Perhaps I didn't make myself clear. I'm looking for a script. I can't be bothered with anything else. 
Jesus Christ, he's gonna suck all the tobacco out in that pipe. <laughs> exactly! Are all people in the entertainment business this... weird? Yes. I mean, look at- look at- look at the hall- look at Hall Life. <laughs> <laughs> look at Niji Sanji. Look at this show go. <laughs> look at Markiplier. Just look at Aaron Hansen from Game Grumps. Like, nine out of ten of his jokes are poop jokes. That's about it. Look at the Goons podcast. <laughs> they really, they talked about, they had a whole two hour session of content of CSGO with talking about 11 billion crabs <laughs> and, breaking gra and breaking bad references. That's uh, all they did. And they kept on talking for two hours. Have you watched Snapcube? Like, they make Shadow, Silver, and Sonic gay. <laughs> God, I've seen that. I love I love the voice actor who did Eggman. Eggman. Oh yeah, Paper Eggman. Box House. He, you know, you know what's uh, you know funny. I remember one scene where it was like, I feel like he like he didn't know the island was supposed to explode, and everyone was like, Oh yeah. Albert, I hope you know. Like, Albert, I hope you know the uh, the island that's exploding. Yeah, it actually doesn't work. Wait, dead serious? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then the spaceship scene. <laughs> I am sad, Undertale. <laughs> <laughs> My god, I loved it. Especially love, like, where they- You have to get a group of people just, like, just to do, like, weird stuff. You have to do it with Undertale, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> New <laughs> content idea. Yes! Oh my god. Uh, let's see. I actually had to skip out on doing Pokemon Scarlet yesterday. So if we could oh. try to get a time together, we could probably go this Friday, maybe. I'm down for it. Yeah. Well, let's see. Well, yeah, cause tomorrow I'm doing Frontiers, cause I'm about nice. I'm about to I'm about to fight the Titan for for Ares Island. I'm nice. excited. Uh, Thursday though, I need to get back to Skyward Sword. Uh, the mic fly. <laughs> <laughs> Master, there is a ninety-five percent chance that the Triforce is located here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, oh, there's. Uh, sorry if we're like, uh, like digressing from the main story, but something I want to point out. It's like, uh, one of the dungeons in Skyward Sword is actually based off of an old Buddhist tale. And it's kind of... kind of dark. Mm. Um, it's basically about a thief who, because he saved the spider, Buddha believes he deserves a second chance. And there was a golden spider in heaven. And so he takes, like, you know, he takes the string, he lowers it down into hell, and the thief sees it, and he starts trying to climb up it. But other people start climbing up after him, and it's like, no, this is only me. It's it belongs to my. It belongs only to me and myself. <laughs> the spider silk broke, and he's right back to square one. And in that, oh, no. and in that story, the the version of Helen there is really kind of like uncomfortable. There's like a river of blood, and then there is a mountain of needles you have to climb. Uh, I can only picture like, like something out here, uh, Bruce Lee. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's like a, it's like that episode of Sponge. I'm thinking of that episode from SpongeBob where Sandy is like, "We gotta find a piece of hay, a piece of hay in a needle stack." <laughs> oh, oh, I don't think I remember that. I remember the arm crusher. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, anyways, uh, let's let's get back to the game. Yeah. Wait. Yes? If you see Manila, give him this. Why do we have to do your errands? I I don't think I like her. Don't cry. She'll take it as a sign of weak she'll take it as a sign of weakness. Alright, we'll give it to him if we see him. Uh <laughs> Did you read? Did you see what the memo said? Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's the one thing. Oh my god. 
She is so stuck up. I like the fact that, like, I like the fact that this is taking place in America. <laughs> yeah. Like, in Japan, it takes, in, in the Japan relationship, it takes place in Japan, this place in Los Angeles. Mmm. They actually did, like, a live adaptation of Phoenix Ride, if I remember correctly. Oh, yeah, they did. They did a real-life baseball as well. No. <laughs> I have played the entire crowd baseball. It was, like, 50 people baseball. <laughs> uh, here, I got this from the producer. The script for episode 13? Episode 13. Where did I put that one? I must have left it somewhere. Up my ass. <laughs> <laughs> my ass. Uh, my ass. Wait, wait, what the hell? Yeah, it says it says it's pwned if he don't find it. Oh, is this the wait? Did they? Did, I don't think I remember this being said in the original. Unless this is like remaster. The, this is the trilogy, so I'm pretty sure they would like update the graphics and they might have like changed some of the like lines or something. Uh oh. I suppose I don't make it. <laughs> Nick, it might be quicker to just look in all the places where he's likely to have been. I agree. Okay, cool. Thanks for your help. Right, that's, 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 that's great. I think I know where yeah, it is. It's, it's like. Where would it be? Well, oh crap, not that one. Uh, let's go I back to. the kid took it. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm thinking. I don't think it's safe to have the cameras turned off. Yeah, no. Stuff could still happen. Uh... One, maybe. Yeah, oh yeah, it's on the chair. Back at the scene of the oh, crime. That's what we need here to get out of here quick, Nick. Uh, it has to be, like... How long do you think it's been since, like, the first, like... Since the turn up, since the round, uh, the trial with Mia, like how long do you think it's been since uh, the trial? They don't give a year stamp, do they? They just give like a month stamp. Probably a month. Yeah, it's probably been a month because there's no way. Because I doubt Mia will only be around like dead body, like where people were dead before. Yeah. Didn't he say he left it somewhere? Aha! Found it, Nick. The script. Good work. Oh, yeah, it looks nasty. Uh, don't want to know where it's gone. Oh. I would. I would never touch that. This. Oh. Let's just give it to the woman. She can. She can deal with it later. Yeah. We'll happily give it to her. Oh uh, God. Here. Take it. Take it. <laughs> and it's like the like Phoenix and Maya are wearing hazmat suits, and they just hand it to her with an extended arm. Here, we found it. Your script. Uh, script handed to D. Vasquez. Why is it sticky? <laughs> <laughs> I was just gonna say script. <laughs> um, uh, you're not gonna talk to us? Quiet. The script. <laughs> I'm reading. <laughs> oh, what is she? A, what are you, a librarian? <laughs> Just you hold on, what's the big idea? Who do you think you are anyway? And and do you even know who we are? Powerless lawyers? Um, right. Am I a suspect? No, it's just... Well, no, but... You wanted to know about the day of the murder? Yes. Anything you could tell us would be a big help. You know, there was a meeting here at noon. Yes, with the director and the people from the network. Correct. Now listen closely. None of the people in this trailer were at that studio went to Studio One. It was impossible for us to leave. We are locked inside. <laughs> Manila locked us in the goddamn Idiot. Impossible. Why? The pack was locked. 
Uh, well, okay. Looks like I was right. Looks like I was close. Yeah. <laughs> Manello fell asleep on the job again. The path? I was fixing to say, it's like, what was? What does it need to show me? On the day of the murder, the path that leads here was blocked. We saw Mr. Monkey on the way here, correct? M Mr. Monkey? The monkey with the broken head? Oh, right, that. What an original name. The head fell over in the wind on the day of the murder. Didn't stop moving the head out of the way until after three. Wait, hold on. I don't get. Hold on. Hold on. Mm. What? After three? Hmm. Wait. See. The murder happened at 2.30, yeah. and that picture that was taken at, was at 2 o'clock. Yeah. But, but that head was, like, there until, a, until after 3. So either the murder did happen at Studio 1, or it happened before, and they couldn't move it until after 3. But my thing is, is that, like, why would this, like, still impede your progress? Like, you can just climb over the thing, right? Climb over the tree and such and walk around? Like, I know it feels yeah, a bit just, tedious. Who, who thought of planting millions of fucking trees? It's like, <laughs> I call it, like, like, look at the tree placement! I know. <laughs> I guess, I guess if it's something like Steel Samurai, there's gonna have, like, scenes where it's thick forestry everywhere. Right, fair enough, fair, wait, fair enough. I think they, right, Salmonella said that, uh, that the studio was, like, on the brink of, like, bankruptcy, and now, and she bought that. Yeah. So I guess they didn't have the budget to, like, have, like, grade-A studios. Yeah. It was after four, but, it was after four by the time the path was unblocked. So it took an hour to move a monkey head. Hmm. Capiz? Oh, we don't know really, like, what the material of that monkey was made out of. Concrete. It has to be. Yeah. Everyone in this trailer was stuck here until the path was clear. Stuck in this trailer. Stuck until after 4. Hammer died at 2.30. Thus, none of us could have gone to Studio 1. What? It's true. A crane came by, came just after 3 o'clock to move the head. We called some people. We called some people in to clear the way. I'm sure they corrupt. They corrobor corroborate my story. That's a weird word. Yeah. Well, wait. What if the head fell over after 2:30? Then you could have gone to Studio One. 2:30. The time of death. Very well. Come. That's Mr. Monkey. When it wasn't broken, it announced the time in ooks. One ook per hour. Ook, 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 ook. Okay, what the hell? And what is it? Oh, what? You're not really like a good poet, Miss Desk has. You might just want to stick with being a producer. Mr. Ooking. It is a monkey after all. Check its head. The clock inside stopped when it broke. Nick, it stopped at 2.15! 2.15? That's right. So... The path was blocked from 2.15 till after 4. Path... Blocked... Therefore, we're innocent. Mr. Hammer died Mr. in Studio... Ham oh, yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Mr. I'm sorry, I thought that was Vasquez. <laughs> Mr. Hammer died in Studio 1 at 2.30. See? Goodbye. Mr. Monkey's head data added to the court record. What do we do, Nick? There isn't anyone besides WP who could have killed Hammer. 
It's over. We're finished. It sure doesn't look good. Guess we should head back to the office and plan our strategy. Well, there's one thing we haven't. Well, there's one thing we just realized. What's that? Remember the uh, bottle we found? Yeah, sleep pills. What is the detection sensor? Oh, <laughs> sorry, sorry. Now what? We're fresh out of clues. Everyone's alibi is watertight. We don't even have any promising leads. Things are looking pretty What's good. What's that bottle we found, Nick? <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Here we go. Oh boy. <laughs> I don't think I know who this is. Oh yeah. <clears throat> uh. Let's see. If my voice was, <clears throat> it's a little early for giving up, don't you think? Huh? You got one lead. Fia, it's you. What took you so long? Sorry, Phoenix. Maya has trouble calling me unless she's really in trouble. Right! Oh, wait. I guess that means we're really in trouble. I'd say so. What did you mean, we have one lead? Boy, of course. Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But, but no way am I telling you, losers. <laughs> oh, God. I thought I was hearing <laughs> the Cartman voice. <laughs> Oh god, I'm trying to remember what that clip, what that scene was in South Park. <laughs> How would you like to suck my balls? <laughs> How would you like to suck my balls? And pulls out a megaphone. Yeah. Hey, did, you say, did you say what I think you just said? Oh, I'm sorry, let me just say it louder. <laughs> How would you like to suck my balls? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I well, Cosmo's bitch is big ass bitch is the biggest bitch in the whole wide world. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. <laughs> that have you was... seen the recent episode? I haven't seen the recent episode, but my god, if I... You guys are still going. I know! <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, either way, we should go back to the studio. My boy is our last hope, Phoenix. Thanks. Now I'm more worried than I was before. Using... The fact that The fact that Mia and Maya have the ability to, like, well, mostly me, I'm pretty sure, because she has the ability to, like, she, like, possess a person and change their body type. Exactly! Like, what? God, this is kind of weird. We need to get into the Did studio. She her... Wait, hold on. Did she grow her mole as well in the process? I think so, yeah! <laughs> I'm looking... Yeah, she does have a mole. The... <laughs> That's a beauty spot, mind you. Yeah, I think moles is, like, something that kind of sticks out, kind of like a zit. While a beauty spot is just a dark spot on someone's face. You know, like with Fauna or Samus. Oh, yeah. So, do you have any insight ideas about who might have done this? You don't have enough information to make a case yet. Where have I heard that phrase before? So that's where Maya got it from. <laughs> okay. Of course. Also, just like... How old was Mia? Hang on, go to court records and see. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure she might be on TV. How, okay, first off, how old is that? 34? She's 34. This kid's 7. What? Hmm. God. Oh, more like 10 or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> also, it's like... <laughs> well, I doubt a 7 year old has the vocabulary of a fucking teen. <laughs> yeah. I, oh, hold on a second. Go ahead.
Uh, sorry about that. <laughs> it's it's alright, I'm looking at the evolution of power bill. Okay. Oh, they're already making a Dune Part 2. What's that? They're making a Dune Part 2. Oh, oh a Dune or Dune? Dune. Oh, okay. The movie Dune with like... Zendaya um, and Jason Momoa. That one? Yeah, yeah, those two. Okay. I, don't, I don't know who their names are. <laughs> Zendaya and... I never watched the movie. Oh. <coughs> yeah. Alright, so we have... A grown-up Mia, uh, who changed her little sister's body, uh, and now we're about to go. Uh, and now we're about to go talk to a little boy. That's a, that's a, that's a big. Oh, there's a whippersnapper. <laughs> okay, so this is October, and if this yeah. is in the same year, it's probably in the it's, same year. Yeah. I th so it was probably August that case happened. Yeah. That was a long time ago. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> Look, Miss Oldbag, I got some. I got an actual woman this time instead of whatever you are. <laughs> uh, 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 Jesus. What's wrong? Jeez. Uh, Whooper snapper. He's been chasing that boy this whole time. So he didn't have a heart attack. Yeah. When I catch him? Uh, I think she's about uh, to have a heart attack. What? What did I catch? Uh, Sounds like she hasn't had any luck catching him. Uh, I got a hostage now, whippersnapper. A hostage? Okay. Um, what happened to the boy? Uh, if I see him again, uh... Uh, uh, land threat. Uh, 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 well, we don't know how old you are. Alright, if you're gonna lay him flat, you need to get consent first before you do anything. My, what a violent old lady. Actually, I met with the director just now. Eh? Oh, my heart. Oh, I feel so good. You okay? Before I go, I'd like to visit where the place where poor Hammer died. Right. She was saying she wanted to visit the studio where he died. Did she just said that? It's like... What's this about a hostage? <sighs> when that boy was running away, uh, he dropped this and ran. Uh, I'll come back for this one. Kind of hard to understand her with all that huffing and puffing. Phoenix, that hostage might be what you might be what we need. Cody might talk we'll to us to get him back. We'll force the information out. Oh, I did. <laughs> see what Phoenix said. I'm catching that breath. Is the last thing I do. Phoenix, do you have anything you might trade with her? A trade? Hmm. I wonder... Do we have anything? Oh, the key! Oh, right! Makes sense. Miss Oldbag, I'm borrowing this, just so you know. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, let's be sure to give it back. Uh, not as demanding when she's exhausted. What you mean? Sleeping pills! Oh, this will put her to sleep. I don't think you actually need one. Give her a picture. What should we take? I told you who I saw. It was powers. Oh, at least she's consistent. Alright. Okay, he just says. Okay, you know what? Let's see what let's see if Penny has anything for her or something like that. Ah! Ah! Wait, wait, what? After maybe after when 
need to all detect the sun. Uh, uh, oh wait, all all the sun. Let's move. Let's go somewhere else. Let's go to the boy over here. Oh, here we go. Hey, it's Cody. Hey, you. Wait a second. Phoenix, what's up, the boy? Yeah, his name's Cody Hacken. I think you're ready for the dressing room. Oh god. Please don't tell me something else is going here. Found you! Dang it, just get in the way! Come back! There, get back. <laughs> How did she. Hey there, would you mind helping us out? Please? Oh no. I'm Cody. Hello, Cody. I'm Mia. Mia Faye. Nice to meet you. Yo! And I'm Phoenix Wright. Who asked? <laughs> Damn! <laughs> this kid! <laughs> Motherfucking kid clutch didn't ask. <laughs> Phoenix, you can take it from here. I'm not so sure I'm qualified. I have a feeling. <laughs> yeah. I have a feeling. So Samurai's so cool. I think he's the, um, the bomb. Oh, God. Boomer. God, and we're at that age. We're at that age. We're the same age as this guy. No. The bomb anymore. Oh. Ha, <laughs> who would a lame like you know about the Steel Samurai? Hey, what's that attitude? Yeah, I think you shouldn't yell like that. He's only a kid. Yeah, don't yell like that. I'm only a kid. Oh, Jesus. Uh, so, do you know anything about what happened here? Could you please, could you tell me, please? I don't know nothing. Hmm. Looks like a little persuasion is necessary. Maybe a bribe? Hey, Mia! Uh, what we, what can, hey, Mia! <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, Mia! Fuck your tits on him. <laughs> oh god, yeah, I still don't want to go to freaking Mia. Why does not want to go to Mia? We all want to know. Anyways, um... 28 in the... I think she was 28 to be honest. Okay. What do we have in the court record anyway that can be given to the... Oh, wait, hang on. Oh. No, I, I think we're supposed to go back to here. Let's go to let's go to the studio one. Wait, maybe there's something in studio one. Uh, let's see what we got. Let's take one of the let's take one of the cards from the fucking uh, <laughs> dead body. Oh. <laughs> uh, I think both of them go bankrupt for sure. I'm uh, surprised he didn't go bankrupt already. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, is this fat Shay Manila? Yeah. <laughs> surprised they don't have. Oh, I'm surprised they don't have an extra large one for Mr. Manila. I thought that was the chair for Mr. Manila. Jeez. Might call it a reflecting board or something. Uh, uh, okay. Okay, maybe there's something in Studio Two. I think I know what we can do next, but. Let's go through every trailer. Yeah. Bottle of water. No clues here. Never mind. This is where they had the meeting. Our documents and papers got scattered around. What's in the trash bin? That trash bin looks suspicious. Just like here, that could be a clue. <laughs> Just some paper cups and a couple documents. Okay. I think I know what we have to do. Go to Studio One. There's a lot of this. No. Move. Employee area. Move. Dressing room. Hey, kid. The steel and the hammer ice beer. That's totally cool. I wish I had one too. Kid and Maya would get along great. Damn it! Dang it. <laughs> I thought that was what we had to do. Let's give the kid a picture. Oh, the fucking... Let's get the pit... Let's get the picture. Hey, it's the Steel Samurai. Huh? Why is he dragging his foot like that? Where'd you get this, anyways? 
shot. What? Okay, that didn't work. Key card. Yeah. Hey, kid. How about instead of having to sneak in, I just give you the pass in. That's that boring. Man, how could one person be so lame? If you were a superhero, you'd be lame, oh man. Okay. Nah, that'd be Amber Heard's uh, mail. <laughs> God! <laughs> uh, um... What's in the... Okay, what's in the employer? Maybe there's something in there. Wait, what did the kid drop anyway? Didn't the kid drop something before yeah. he, like... The sleeping pills! No, wait, no. What? <laughs> kid drop the sleeping pills. No, wait, hold on. This is the hospital. Drop this in hand. He dropped this in red. What did he drop? Phoenix, the hostage knows what you need, including my phone. He gets that. Oh, but no! I'm getting that bread if it's the last thing I do. Phoenix, do you have anything you might trade with her? Trade? Ah. What would we trade with her? We already tried the sleeping um, pills, didn't we? The card. Key card. Key card. Oh, right. Oh, yeah. Okay. Hey, that. Hey. Oh, sorry. That. Huh. That's a card. Do you one? Oh, that's it. That's it. Right, a card key to Studio One. Oh, it makes sense now! It, the hint the hint was in what she said. She wanted to go visit Hammer's death site. Oh my god. I had to visit. He died. Yes, Ooh. we know he died. He died a very I'm tragic... His friend. You don't have your own card, Miss Old Bag? Do you want is a matter? <sighs> you let me borrow? Borrow it then? I give her the card keys and I won't be able to get into Studio One. Lend her the card keys. Ah, we already finished what we got there anyway. Why don't you let her borrow it, Phoenix? I guess it can't hurt. Here you go, Miss Old Bag. Card key lent to Miss Old Bag. Okay, she's calm now, Jesus. Listen to me, Sonny. I don't like having depths to no whippersnappers. Ah. You take this, and we're even. Deal? What's this? A Steel Samurai trading card? That sneaky kid dropped it. I figure it's pretty important to him, though. I think she cares a bit. Yeah. Thank you. I'm gonna have a use for this. Must be the hostage she was talking about. That's right. I'm off. So long, old bag. Yeah. <laughs> Aggressive typing. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I see the lady in the red dress. I see the river sticks. <laughs> Here she goes, hobbling off towards the studio. All right. Alright, let's get into it. Hey, kid. These are mine now. Want some blades? Cody, does this look familiar? Hey, my you are! You are? Huh? You oh are. Oh my god. You know, ultra rare. That card's really hard to get. Okay. <laughs> Man, for the growing fact up. That we know what that means. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Phoenix over here is like, who is out of his mind? <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> I'll give you this, if you help me. But that's my card! If I offer me something I already own, you're in effect... It's... It's you in the very basis of our consumer society, namely the principle of fair trade. And for a grown up, you sure are dumb. What do they teach these kids at school these days? What's this? Kid's only seven. It's like... It's more like a situation of, like, if you tell me what I want to know, I'll give you back what you own. Or, if you don't, I'm keeping these. Or, worse for you, this you are is going through the paper shredder. You know what's weird? Are they teaching kids like law firm like stuff? <laughs> like, did they, like did they did they did they did Phoenix like did they pass this just barely to just realize that oh fuck we need, we need to update our fucking learning our teaching abilities on the law firms. Oh. Hey, Jirachi's <laughs> in the call. Hey, Jirachi. 
Whatever, I don't need that card. Huh? I got a double. Yo. Hey, what's up? Hey. Oh, we're currently, Watch uh, what's up? nothing much. We're currently live right now. Uh, well, I'm currently live on YouTube, but we're doing voices for, uh, the characters from Phoenix Wright. Mmm. You want to join in? Uh, sorry, I I have no like direction. I've never played Phoenix Wright. No, no, you don't need to. You don't need to. You just need a voice. Yeah. 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 It, it... Shit. Uh, uh, no. Uh, I don't know how long I can stay online. Probably won't be for very long, to be uh, honest. Okay. Aww. That's fine. All right. Don't worry. <laughs> What? After I went through all that? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, he could, he could mumble like when, like from the gallery rail. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got him! Ah, uh, you... Ah, uh, you son of a gun. <laughs> <laughs> you want to trade? Find me a really rare card. Really rare? You mean there's something ra rarer than ultra rare? Ultra rare premium cards are way rarer than plain ultra cards. Come on. Man, for good, I'm sure I'm dumb. Premium... Rare. What do I feel like we're talking about? Steaks! Oh boy. Ooh, Salmonella, my yeah, god. Yeah, that might, that's like probably our hint. He, ha he definitely has to. He's literally the type of guy who would collect yeah. trading cards. He's the freaking director. Uh, Why wouldn't he have merchandise of his own fucking thing? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, so, uh, something real quick. I recently got my hands on a game that I want to use for one of my projects. Let me go get it real quick. Sweet. Mm -hmm. How you doing, Jirachi? So I've got a... Oh, I'm you alright. I'm just trying to deal with life, you know? No, uh, yeah, I understand. Mm -hmm. So, uh, just to kind of bring a pause to the stream for a moment here, um, I think, I'm pretty sure I mentioned Project Red a bit, and what it is, it's essentially like a documentary style, like, series I'm wanting to do. Following a character, going through the regions. Um, but I figure, probably be the best way to show it, if I do this game right here, which is Pokemon Coliseum. And my thinking is, since, you know, we're writers and such, we could probably, like, build upon the story in here. And like, yeah, like you know, have a voice for Wes, and you know, like, what he's thinking, what his personality is. Basically, we're just narrating a story, and trying to give like that's... good visuals and such. Yes, I would that, love that. that. Wes is like one of the coolest too. So yeah, that's the, uh, I'm trying to remember who called what called team. That's the one with the. It's uh, the one with the. Sh it's the one where you're going around stealing Pokemon from ba from bad guys. That's the one. It was the weird arm mm -hmm. technique. Yes. Yeah, with the machine arm. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't, wasn't there like a sequel, like Gale of Darkness? Yeah. Or yes. Or so? That I don't. I have never yet. see. I never heard there was a sequel. Yeah, I didn't know about it until Chugga uploaded the video of XD Gale of Darkness. I never knew it until J Jade and Animations did like did a video on it. Wow. And the. I learned a Coliseum from Chugga. I didn't know that XD was a sequel game. I played that when I was a kid. Yeah, I... XD, what's X, wait, that XD is It's Gale of Darkness. Darkness. It's called, okay. the full name is Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. Yeah, and wow. on, and on the cover art, it has a dark Lugia, who... I can only assume is a big trouble for our heroes. He's literally the final boss of the game, Yeah. Dude. Yeah, so... I'm thinking that... What we could do, and it's and it's easier for us to kind of schedule and do because really, if we're just narrating, we just get certain lines, get certain voices, and we like narrate it out, try to give some visuals, and make a series. We'll have like character interactions between Wes and Misty Two Point um, and I I feel like this I feel like that's a game Bunny would love because the two starter Pokemon you get in the game. Maybe only for that reason. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Because uh, the entire game is double battles, which means every single fight you have two Pokemon out at the same time. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. And the two starter Pokemon you get, it's not any of the starters from the mainline games. It's actually Espeon and Umbreon. Huh. And, and there are, like, crazy attention to detail. Like, I... 
it's so it's so freaking good. It's like what I want to do is I want to. I'm debating on whether or not to record or stream it. Um, that way I can just be like, yeah, you know, this is this game here we're playing. Uh, it's an RPG. We're gonna try to catch all the shadow Pokemon we can. And this game is actually important for Project Red because it has some Johto Pokemon that I could try and get traded over, as well as the certain legendaries, uh, like mm -hmm. like yeah. So there is the three dogs, uh, Celebi, and you can also get Ho Oh. Yes. Oh God! But if you want to get Ho Ho, you have to. You literally have to do all hundred floors of Mount Battle. I know. That's gonna. That's. I might do. <laughs> I might record. I might probably do like record the series based on how I record a lot of the videos I do. I get the game itself, a separate recording of the audio, and a separate recording of my webcam. I could use the gameplay footage that I make in order to like, I don't know give visuals and such, play the cutscenes. And all, uh, and you know, as we're crafting the story, I could ask certain, like some of you guys on Discord, really just to try and send me audio clips, uh, and all. I feel like that'd be a very fun thing to do on here. Oh hell yeah! yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna mess around and just be like Morgan Freeman. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, I could probably do like we could probably do a bunch of recording sessions where we're voicing the characters as is, but then when it comes down to like, because like this right. one's kind of like a se more serious story I want to do, but for these like recordings and streams, we could just do kooky voices and such. Yeah, that's true. That's mm -hmm. true. Yeah. So anyone watch? Yeah. So anyone watching the live stream, if you guys want to see some of that, leave a comment below and <laughs> leave <laughs> like and subscribe. Like and uh. subscribe. <laughs> Let's get this mm -hmm. man to what's it? What's what's your sub goal again? It's five hundred for Project Red and a thousand for the Honey Pop stream. Let's go. Come on, I'm sure you guys can do it. Get this man to his goals. Get this. Man. We're I think we're currently sitting at three seventy five, so we're close to one of the goals. Oh, hi, it's Penny. Oh, hi. Hello. What brings you here? Oh, well, I had to arrange some stuff. Um, yes? The, um, girl with you, doesn't she seem a little <clears throat> different? Like, is she even the same person as before? Um, nope, she's the same as always. Same as always. Okay, whatever you say. Ah, uh, yeah, she grew tits in the middle of the fucking day. <laughs> it's, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Dry, I'll send you a couple of pictures on Discord, don't worry. It'll all, it will make sense when we try to explain. Get on day off? Have you seen that voice in Sen? No? You missed me. <laughs> UK Jirachi. I'm debating if I need to run away. Don't worry, don't worry. It's perfectly fine. Welcome like... to Ace Attorney. Yeah. <laughs> Do you yeah. think that's weird of what we're gonna voice? Me and Zelda are just planning to do Undertale if we can. Yes. <laughs> oh god, no, not Undertale. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, so is it like like the general acceptance of the audience that Papyrus sounds either like Waluigi or like Skeletor? <laughs> I was thinking of I mean, both. I say Waluigi. But well, that's I say just Skeletor me. and Waluigi. Yeah. Skeluigi. 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 Oh my goodness. Confirmed oh my for the uh, new Smash Bros. I hope you're con uh, excited, guys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Sans is in Smash Brothers, so why not? <laughs> Internet oh went crazy for Sans. I know. <laughs> Better than Sora. I oh, know. Yeah. It's crazy. My boy Sora needs some more love. Oh yeah. <laughs> All the posters on the wall here, man. Uh, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I don't know, Jirachi. I think Sora got enough love because I, I, my ear, I couldn't hear my ears. I couldn't hear anything after the screaming I heard from the reactions. <laughs> uh, I guess, but now, now he's just kind of been pushed aside for uh, other characters like Joker. Yeah. No one uses him. 
<laughs> says the guy who plays Bowser. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, you know, like I've been actually could I fit that into the series? I've been thinking of doing like you know three games for streaming, and two of them, of course, are like Final Fantasy and Kingdom Hearts, since you know. Kingdom Hearts has some characters from Final Fantasy. Mm -hmm. uh, Ooh, that's a big series to cover, man. I know. Like I, 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 I mean, at least at least it's not. I mean, the pixel remaster of some of the games are out now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But I'm just trying to figure out what that third game would be if I wanted to do Kingdom Hearts and uh, Final Why Fantasy. Why not do the Trinity? I mean, Square Enix owns Kingdom Hearts, right? Well, like what I mean is, <laughs> like games I'm streaming, like. Uh, next to each other, like, like I don't want to play Yakuza Zero, and then after that, just start after like a streaming session of that game, immediately start playing Yakuza, well, it's the whatever the base like Yakuza game there is, because it's yeah. like kind of skipping ahead in the story. So yeah, yeah. With this, it's like okay, well, these two games I like to stream because. One is just, you know, an original game, and another one is a mixture of Disney and Final Fantasy. Yeah. So it's either I could probably yeah, yeah. find some final, some Disney game to play, or just have another game that's in the same kind of like category and such as those two games. Like, you ever play Xenoblade? Uh, oh, that's a good game, I should. Yeah, I've been actually been saving Xenoblade to stream. I actually do another have one, Xenoblade. Another, another one, I, another game I was interesting was like, Dragon Quest Eleven, it, like it's an it's an own Ooh, story you don't yes. have to play. Mm. Like it's its own story. It's uh, every every game, like every like three games, like of of Dragon Quest is like its own timeline. Mm -hmm. You got uh, mm -hmm. one, two, three, which is like its own world. Four, five, and six, it's an its own world again. Um, and then the rest, I I'm pretty sure it's like separate worlds, but they're connected somehow. Yeah, um, actually. I'm thinking I might could probably do some streamings of those games because I had bought Chrono Trigger on Steam. That's a good game. So I could do Ooh. that. Uh, one of the Dragon Quests, and maybe like a Dragon Ball game, since they're all they all have the same visual appearance because they're both made by Akira Toriyama. So. <clears throat> Oh well, yeah, Final Fantasy, Dragon Quest, and Chrono Trigger are made by the same developers as well. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. They, yeah, no, they are. I think that's the, the running joke. Is Square Enix has all the fan favorite characters, and they do absolutely jack shit with them. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get me wrong. I love Square, but I also hate them. <laughs> yeah. I just I my favorite game on like in the in the Nintendo area, like DS era, was either Dragon Quest V for the DS, or Professor Layton series. Mm. Ooh, I totally forgot there was a Layton title yeah. around that time. I know, the, the Professor Layton coming back. Yeah. yeah. Yes. And not only that, like, yes. and not only that, like, and kind of in like, what is it? Um. Similar uh, on theme with this stream here, they actually did a crossover with uh, Phoenix Wright. Yeah, they did that for the DS. Oh, yeah. That's when they introduced the, uh, well, I'm pretty sure they introduced the jury system that was later brought into the Great Ace Attorney Chronicles. Ah. And that game mm. I also have, so. That'd be awesome. I. Here's what I'm thinking. with Based on how Red is gonna go. I'm gonna have to go into the DS games, but yeah. since the eShop never had any of the Pokemon games, which, by the way, like rest in peace, Nintendo eShop. Uh, rest in peace. But it's like, in the arms of an angel. I mean, like when Amazing it. Amazing <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> but, um, but like getting getting footage for that is gonna be difficult because there's no like. You know, like separate capture device. I either have to pirate or buy, yeah, buy a game capture or emulate it. Or I I have to or I might have to send in one of my DSs to get modded. 
which is most likely going to have to be this version, the old version I have, uh, and have that sent in to be modded so that I can not only do Diamond, Pearl, Heart Gold, Soul Silver, but also to transfer games from Fire Red, Leaf Green, Emerald, Ruby, and Sapphire. You'd also yeah. need it for Black and White too, wouldn't you? Uh, yeah, Black and White and Black and White 2 as well. I might. Yeah. Do you, uh, could I get away with like uh, just having one of each of those games? Because I have Black 2, I think. So if I get like one of the white or black or white, oh, actually, if I were to get white, would I still be able to cover both those grounds since I can like trade them over? That... It should work in the Pokemon Bank. I'm not sure how that should. Works. Yeah, but I and I'm, I don't I'm, know. But I'm like talking about like trading between the games because they're both Unova. Granted, one has like oh yeah, black, black, black and black and white are compatible with black two and white two. Yeah, if that's what you're asking. Yeah, that that's primarily what I'm trying to do because it's like completing the Pokedex. <laughs> it wouldn't make sense to like separate separate like like black like the uh, Pokemon black players and against the Pokemon white players. <laughs> I mean, like yeah, no man. I mean, we've seen the. The characters from each of those games. Certain ones. <laughs> I was glad and Iris in the game. Oh mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, see the penny there's a card she needs from this. <laughs> Getting back to <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we have we have a, yeah. yeah, let's get back to the voice again. Yeah. I have a feeling she was like a quiet kid, like, but with explosive personality. She just tries to hide it. Yeah. Oh, do you think the Penny in Pokemon Scarlet's gonna be like this? <laughs> Probably not. Uh, I like the I like the shy Penny in there. <laughs> yeah. That's it. That's the card I need. <laughs> you know how long I've been looking for it. Uh, I don't care what kind of girl you might think I am. I need that card. Please, I beg you. Please trade with me. Trade that's with a, you. That's a holy cow. Yes. Change your personality. Sure, eight cards. Look, I'll even trade an ultra rare premium card. Trade me a, huh? Yes, it's a good deal for your ultra rare. Please. Phoenix, can't you see she's desperate? What's everyone getting so excited about? Trade it. <laughs> trade it. Yeah, we gotta trade it. Okay. Really? Thanks. This is for you. Ultra rare. Premium. URP. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> And there she goes. Oh my god. <laughs> I need to see this in the anime again. I need yeah. to watch the anime again. Oh my again. god. It's so like... Whoa, whoa, back up. Did you just say anime in relation to Phoenix, right? Yes. Is that a thing? There is yeah, an there's anime. an anime. Oh there's my anime. god. Can you imagine? Oh my god, I need to find this now. I yeah. need this in my life. You'll love it. It's uh. a great thing. They made a live action and I've watched it. It's funny as hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh. But uh... What? Could you imagine you know if... what's fun? What's that? You know what's funny? I'm surprised that a lot, like, a lot of series stuff is like novels and then into manga and then into anime. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, mm -hmm. but then you have like series like Godzilla, which started off as live action, mm -hmm. then, then into like, then into like TV shows and then into, and then into like, uh, anime. You know what's, you know what was surprising me? Like, is that this year, Common Rider finally got its own anime. Mm. And it's actually a continuation of the series. Yeah. Well, after the one. Hmm. Um, I'll be I'll be right back. So you can voice since it's only the kids, I'm gonna yeah. I'll be right back. Yeah, okay. Um Alright. But yeah, but I uh but Phoenix Wright it's I like Phoenix Wright series. Because it's like a it's a murder mystery of sorts, and you're going you're actually just going to trial and and doing and you know uh, yeah solving it. Uh, <laughs> I just never. Hmm. Uh, I was I was just gonna say it's like there is so you've heard of Marvel vs. Capcom, right? Yes. Yeah. Apparently, um, I I kind of <laughs> wonder what it would be like if you know Phoenix Wright were to team up with She Hulk. Like a good she hulk oh my... not <laughs> Oh my god, no. Listen, oh, no. listen, shield is powerful enough. Actually, now that I think about it, the two of them would be clashing against each other, because she hulk's a prosecutor, isn't she? 
Yes. And that is canon. Yeah. That's a thing. And Wright's a defense attorney, so that that would be kind of an interesting case to see. You know, if it was if it's written well, of course. I'm just picturing the two of them like bickering back and forth, like like pretty much every time you see them on screen, but they're just having like good bants back and forth just <laughs> all yeah. the time. Constant funny. Yeah. It's like a, it could be one of those like versus things. It's like um But it's like, um, Miles and She-Hulk could be working together while Phoenix and Matt work together. That'd be really yes. cool. Yes. Be the guard. Yeah, so, please. that's it. Make it a good one. Make it a good one. Well, you know what? We could probably just do that kind of, like, project on our own. <laughs> or just simply put, just read out fanfics. <laughs> Well, I mean, that's basically what you were suggesting that we do with Wes, because we would have to write out dialogue for the man. True, true. And I mean, like, Batman versus Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I mean, that, what, technically fanfiction? Technically? Yeah. Hey, I am all for reading out fanfic. Yes. I am all for it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and it's just trying to come up with, uh, like, the visuals, obviously. I've never seen a picture. Right, okay. Mm -hmm. How about a trade? You're on. I'll give you a samurai spear and throw in an evil magistrate to boot. No, 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 no. Not that kind of trade. I don't want cards. I want information. Huh? You sure? Bye bye me. Key card given to Cody. Okay, Phoenix. Let's see what he has to say. If he knows something that could help us, we could have him take the, take the stand tomorrow. Alright, finally got information from this guy. So, he likes to steal samurai. He's so cool. I. I guess. You're judging him by his looks. You have to look at his actions and his life. I'm being lectured on life by a grade schooler. <laughs> God. You like him too, don't you? Uh, Omi? Yeah, I, um, love the Steel Samurai. So, tell me what your favorite thing about the Steel Samurai is. It's fighting skill. I'm trying to think of something. I like it when he, uh, he vanquishes his foes. Yeah, wazam! Steel Samurai always wins. Always. Check this out, it's my fan album. Wow. Oh, uh, what was the name? What was the. Sumo Slammers, that's what I'm thinking of. From Ben 10. It's basically. <laughs> Listen, I, am, I have a wealth of knowledge on Ben 10. Ben 10 and Ruby, with all the research I've done on both of those <laughs> series for a certain something. Yes. Oh, crap, I just remembered. They just released uh, Justice League and Ruby Part 1. Yes, I know. Have you watched it? I've got my eyes on it. I just got done... I, uh... My, my best friend, Leo, he just finished watching Volume 9 yesterday and we were chatting oh. about it. Okay. You know, I finished watching that a bit ago, though. Like, pretty much as soon as it dropped. Mmm, okay. That's nice. I'm back. Hey, welcome back. Hello, Sins. I just... I just remember... I just thought of something. Like, this kid... It's kind of like Ben 10, except he's not really heroic and stuff. He's just, like, a big fan of... I guess Japanese <laughs> card collecting. So what you're saying is you got to try and pull your best Terra Strong impersonation here, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> got it, yeah. <laughs> uh, I could probably see her voice in this character, you know. She's willing to voice anyone. Dude, she voiced Omi, okay? Um, she, she literally voiced Crazy Omi for Shotgun Showdown. She'll voice anybody. <laughs> voice? I just. My my ear just wow well, battery. <laughs> oh boy, sorry. I know my voice is grating, but uh, on, it's man. fine. You know, like I I I'm willing to bet my voice is grating too. Everyone says that. Everyone says my voice is grating, and then everyone else around them is like, no, it's fine. Yeah. Chill. I've I've been told that I sound like Proton John. <laughs> Listen to me. You are literally <laughs> just American. In Proton John, we've been through uh, this. Move just, just change your name to Proton Zelda. It'll be good. <laughs> uh, maybe, my... maybe, maybe there's a diff there's a lot of so uh, I try to look your name up, and there was like another Zelda master, unfortunately. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, but more successful than I am. He actually had, he actually got to play. Uh, I think he had an early demo of Tears of the Kingdom. I even see I don't I don't think I even see activity on that channel anyway. 
not on that channel. Yeah. Yeah, I've heard some, like, way. some of his recent videos has been like a ROM hack for Ocarina of Time. He did like a final playthrough of Breath of the Wild and then he went on to discussions and stuff. Mm. Yeah. Bad lady. Mm. Now I just gotta I just gotta remember how Ben 10 sounds. Uh <laughs> You literally need me to pull up sound bites of Ben Tennyson. Yeah, I can do it. I can... Oh no, wait, I don't think I can because I might get. You just gotta think of a mature Timmy Turner. A mature Timmy. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh yo, no. Tara strong voice, but Timmy Turner too, didn't she? I think yep. so. Yeah. Yep, she did. She did. Yeah. She was ben one of the voice Ten, actors for Timmy. Ben Ten, Bubbles Bye. from Powerpuff Girls, Timmy Turner. Yup. Uh, Raven from Teen Titans Go. She also, and, yep. Uh, any, every Teen Titans actually. Well, Harley yeah, Quinn Teen and DC, D, Harley Quinn and the Teen Titans, and not Teen Titans, uh, DC Superhero Girls TV show, and and Barbara, uh, Barbara Gordon as well. As well. Yep. Tara Strong. We stand Tara Strong here. Okay. <laughs> we uh, we we strong with strong. We strong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, listen to me. Listen to me. Tara Strong is just awesome. Oh yeah, definitely. That's like one of my. If I had to, if I had to say one of my favorite English voice actors for like cartoons and anime, it has to be Tara Strong. But for Japanese artists, like Japanese VAs, Eliyuki is my mm. my favorite because of Tatsumaki's VA. Tatsumaki's VA. Mm-hmm. She slapped uh, Kirito's voice actor from Thor Online. Oh my god, really? <laughs> yeah, and you know what's also yeah. a, good, a cool thing? Watch she that. got to talk with uh, some of the uh, Hololive members, Matsuri and uh, Miko. Darn, oh, man. Ooh. Neat. Yeah, the first thing she asked Miko was about the recording clip she did when she oh was playing Trombone Champion. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. I saw the clip of was like a trombone champion and she was like, I didn't fart. She's just crying. I didn't fart. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> ah, <Man. baby. laughs> Since you gotta try and join me and Drago in the war whenever we play Fall Guys again. Like, we there was a situation, like, a lot of stuff happened when we were playing that game. Uh, yeah. But unfortunately, we I didn't get any audio from the clips I saved oh. because Dang. I used GeForce Ready Experience and the recording device it chose was my capture card <laughs> instead of my mic. Damn. And it didn't even cap. Oh no, I, I think I think it caught. I didn't. I think it didn't catch my voice. I might have caught the others. Uh. But, I don't know, it's just... Uh, we just gotta do a redo as soon as possible. <laughs> Anyways, isn't that the Steel Samurai's motto? For great justice? You have to help us fight for great justice, too. I... I saw... I saw everything. Well, well, I might get some useful information out of him yet. What you saw? Cody, I need to ask you something very important. What did you see on the day of the incident? I got here that day around 2. I had to come into the woods out back so the old lady wouldn't see me. I got kind of lost though. I was in there for maybe a half hour or so. And I finally got to the studio. After that... What is it, Cody? The seal samurai killed the bad guy. He used a samurai spear. Just like always. One shot, one kill. It happened so fast, I got scared. I went home after that. I... I see. It must have been hard for you. What was that? Jirachi moving around. Oh. Well, oh, well, I gotta go, apparently. I gotta go eat. Oh, uh, okay. That's unfortunate, but it, it was fun. Oh, yeah. This again. Yeah. Alright. Okay. See ya, Zelda. See ya. It is, man. Wait, this... Yeah. Not the close end of the stream right now, actually, because we've gone... Actually, how long has the stream gone for? It's been a, it's been a good... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, that that's a decent amount of stream. I felt like I've streamed for longer. Like, what the crap? <laughs> oh yeah. I mean, I mean to be fair, you've done like five hour streams before, no problem. Come uh, on, dude. <laughs> yeah, I think. I mean, I did twelve hour live streams. 
But that, that there's still that like there's still that 36 or 33 hour live stream I did a Pokemon. <laughs> uh, oh boy. Yeah. So definitely trying to so, shorten it down. So I'm just curious, cause what you what you and Sins were doing can like can the people on YouTube here like who are chatting with you on Discord right now or yeah. I'm like, just curious. Yeah, they're currently able to hear the game, and they're able to hear us on Discord. And that's really about it. Um, interesting. Oh boy. Oh, Gumshoe! Alright, everything. This boy here is key witness. He's under police protection starting now. Come on, son. You've got a rendezvous with me down to the precinct. No, I, I ain't going. Ah! That didn't go so well. Back to zero leads. Now we have a serious handicap in court. What are we gonna do, Mia? Well, hmm. I really need to be going. Don't worry, Phoenix. I'm sure you'll be fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Come to the trial tomorrow, please! I need you there! Phoenix, can I ask you something? Do you really believe that Mr. Powers is innocent? Of course he is! That's all I wanted to hear. Excellent. I'll see you in court then. Great! Thanks, Mia! See you soon. To be continued. Oh, what perfect... <laughs> what perfect timing to end the stream on. Yes. Save the progress. Right. And that's gonna do it here. Uh, title screen. Okay, well, that's gonna do it for this live stream, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, of course, thanks to those who came around to do additional voices. Uh, also, especially thank you to Jirachi for joining in for a little added conversation pieces here and there. Um, I feel like all I did was distract you, though. Why are you thanking me? Oh, well... <laughs> Well, even if, even if it was, like, distracting or such, it was still, like, we were having conversations, we were being active, and we were, like, you know, just chatting, being friendly. We're, true, true. We're true, true. Leaning, well, if I had known you were, if I had known about this sooner, I would have popped in earlier. Yeah. To be honest. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's alright. Uh, but yeah, we're, we're just, we're just sitting back and we're chilling, you know? We're being friendly and mm -hmm. all. Uh, which isn't really a bad thing. A lot of my live streams have been, like, me completely silent because I've just... I'm so hyper focused on what I'm like trying to do. Um, Fair so, enough. So Fair I guess. Enough. Speaking of that, then, do you think you might be able to come by tomorrow and join me for a Sonic stream I'm doing? I'm playing Sonic Frontiers. And Ooh, that's planned. What time? What time? Well, let's see. Well, what time are you available? I guess. Um. Tomorrow's Wednesday, right? Yep. It should be good any time... Actually, wait, no. I should... I think I should be good, like, any time before maybe, like, 5.30 my time, which I think you're an hour before me. Yeah, so let's see. If it's 7, so it's 8.30 where you're at right now, right? Yes. Okay, then. Uh, so, hey, I could just wake up in the morning, uh... Like ping you on Discord or something, and we can hop into VC and we get to hear some more awesome Sonic Frontiers soundtrack. Because I'm right about to fight the Titan on Ares Island. Ooh, you're actually farther in the game than me. Oh, oh, the uh, yeah, it's just a boss fight. Well, where are you at on the game, by the way? Uh, the new game screen. <laughs> 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 well, you are much farther. Than I've heard the soundtrack for the game, brother. That's uh, all I've heard. God, I like. I w I'm excited to hear what this. Oh, there's also like a new uh, feature for Frontiers called the jukebox function. Have you heard of it? Yes. I cannot believe they did it, and I love it. Oh, come on, have faith in Sega. My boys, they they know how to they know how to have fun. Oh yeah, and uh. On the same topic as Sonic, I recently got a game in that I think I... Let's see. The say I was going to record Adventure... A Sonic Adventure or stream Sonic Adventure. Ooh, I, I think I said I was going to... Oh, yeah, I was going to record Sonic Adventure because I'm replacing Sniper Elite. 
So I guess I could start going down the Sonic series. And of course, after... Could. Yeah, and of course... You totally could. And after Adventure 2 comes the good old game that we, both of us would know about from our own childhood. Gee, it's almost like it was our first Sonic game. Exactly. <laughs> Can't wait. I can only imagine just some person who started out on like Sonic 1 or Sonic 2 hearing two people say my first Sonic game was Sonic Heroes and they just like cringe like a little bit of their soul just dies. Yeah. I mean like the so Sonic Heroes isn't really perfect but I liked it. It wasn't Dude, bad. I like it. The story is pretty good and the mm -hmm. soundtrack kicks ass. Yes. What uh, I made of. Um... Uh, the glitches, man. It's just the glitches. That's the problem with, like, most of the games in the Sonic cycle. Yeah. Uh, but I'm looking for. I can't wait to get to that. Because, let's see, after that, Shadow the Hedgehog. And I guess that's just the timeline so far. Oh, I also got Sonic Riders, so I'm looking forward to playing that. Or maybe just Ooh, streaming it. I just bought us something. Do you count Black Knight as part of the timeline? Uh, I don't think so. Because where, okay, where would, um, Sonic Unleashed fit in the timeline? I think, oh, after Shadow. Shadow's, Shadow exists. Okay. Like, he's not in Unleashed, but I think, I think Unleashed falls after Shadow's creation. I could be wrong, though. Mm. Okay, so, like, sometime, I guess Unleashed would be sometime between, he no, uh, Adventure 2 and Heroes, or... Maybe? I don't know. Uh, okay, what system was Unleashed on? It was on the... Was it was on the PS2? Uh, I think PS3, Xbox 360, and the Wii. Or in the Wii. Yeah, you're right. Um, but the only reason I ask is because there's a theory that Unleashed is in between Seven Rings and Black Knight. Um, because... I could believe that. Yeah, because, like, you know, you can just play through the first game. And in Unleashed, in one of the cities, Amy will actually ask Sonic on a date, and you can agree to it. And at the end of Black Knight, uh, Amy talks about how Sonic was late for her, for their date. So mm -hmm. there's that bit of the timeline. Um, Listen, Amy does that in every episode of Sonic X. Don't even pull that as an yeah. excuse, though. Yeah, it's true. She's kind of toned down. She, they they kind of toned that down in Sonic Frontiers. I'm glad. I mean, I like Amy. I've always kind of liked Amy. She's not Blaze, but I like her. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, this... uh, I don't know what's going on. But yeah, so um, Sonic Adventure is going to get recorded, and it's going to replace um, Sniper Elite. Uh, Sonic Frontiers is being streamed tomorrow. I want to say maybe... Okay. Mm, 8.30? Uh, let's see, it would be, which would be 9.30 for you. At night? No, at no night in, in, night? A, in the morning, in the morning. Oh shoot, you're doing, morning you're doing a morning stream for that. Yeah. I mean, gotta get a lot of Sonic in, right? I mean, cross my fingers, hopefully I should be good. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'll hop on Discord and if, uh, shoot me a message before you start scream screaming. <laughs> <laughs> clap, um, clap. Good job, Jirachi. Good job. No, good job. before you start streaming and I'll hop on Discord when I wake up. Okay, yeah. Um, yeah, that way we can, like, go through, we can li at least listen to the awesome soundtrack I'll play. Um, and then there is... Pokemon Coliseum project, which I'll have to work that in. Yeah, and I will definitely be all the Coliseum project. I love the Shadow Pokemon games. Like, yeah, so much. Yeah, so like I'll I'll, I'll just be streaming. I, no, I'm gonna be recording Coliseum, uh, and I can probably try and like you can probably join in for those sessions, and we can probably like. Watch me play. Me and Sims can do voices and such. But then when it comes to the project, you know, once we get all, everything written out and such, definitely send mm -hmm. you some lines you could do. Um, if there are certain characters you wish to do, that has to be ironed out. <laughs> um, let's see. 
I don't know. I guess I'll have to make, like, a lineup of games to kind of knock off and start working on at some point. But anyway, this outro has been stretched Please. out long enough. <laughs> Oh god, I thought you stopped the stream already. No, I Zelda. haven't stopped the stream yet. I was like, why? <laughs> yeah. Professional <laughs> man here. <laughs> really, uh, guys, make sure that he hits his goals if, if you haven't clicked off. Yeah, and if you want some sort of ideas on what Project Red's going to be like, look forward to Project, um... Uh, I don't know. I don't know what we can call that project. I don't know. I'll come up with a name for it.